Okay, we continue with yesterday's experiment. We'll be basically doing the same concept where we are sending an input from iPhone, sending it into Dropbox, where Dropbox will sync it into your desktop, and your desktop will do the processing and send back the image back, the resulting output into your iPhone. Today we'll do it slightly different. Instead of using watch for folder, we'll be using Sikuli. Sikuli is like a visual programming. It's very... It makes programming very easy. It's basically tell computer to do what when it sees something on screen. And you can tell it to click and to drag and drop. And all that with a simple programming. And this will, in fact, tell the desktop computer to drag image. If the image appears on the Dropbox, drag it into Polydroid, and Polydroid will then do the processing. As you already know, Polydroid is really cool software. It turns your photo in uh, so that it looks like Polaroid photo. It's really, really good. Um, yeah. We'll just try to do it. Okay, we'll run the script. Now this, the, the script is watching what's happening. And we will send a photo from the iPhone. Watch me. We'll send this photo. Uploading. Okay. Let's watch what's happening. The photo will show up on the Dropbox and then Sikuli will be smart enough to automatically drag the photo into Polydroid. Now, we already see it happening. Now Polydroid is processing the photo. We can send more photo. Let me drag this. Uploading, sync it into the Dropbox. Again, the same processing happening. I actually set it up so Polydroid will send the photo into this folder called Polydroid, which is in fact inside Dropbox. And so all the resulting image will be inside Polydroid folder when it's finished. Let's send more two more photos. Again. Yeah. This program actually worked by looking at this polar polar droid. It has to be visible and shouldn't be covered. So I can I can just make it always on top. This one always on top. Okay, now Paul Droid is always on top, so it, it won't be covering it. This photo won't be covering it. Um, yeah, of course, you can also take a photo. Just take photo of whatever. Okay. Use it. 
uploading and again it will appear inside this folder the script run again drag it into Polydroid and when it's all done you will get some cool Polydroid photo all processed by this little program of course it won't work okay we have one result already all this won't work if you don't have this sequely very cool program I'll explain it again basically it will wait for this image icon to appear and then when it appears drag it will drag this image into Polydroid that part of Polydroid and then it will delete that image and it will loop and run itself again it's very bad programming but it actually works and let's see the result you got Polydroid photo from the iPhone